We've seen Godzilla evolutions in the past of the main character of the atomic breath, but today we've got the evolution of Godzilla movies from 1954 all the way to the most recent movie. The video is by Kassan. I'll throw him up on the screen right now so you can see him. And let's jump right into it. It also says with facts too, Godzilla, so I don't know. 1954. We're gonna get some facts the with the evolution. Tokyo have many questions. As a 164 foot sea behemoth 1954. From the Pacific to wreak havoc on their town. That the looks terrible. This movie depicts Godzilla's <laughs> fall into insanity and mayhem after an American but I mean, hydrogen bomb crashes in the Pacific off the coast of Japan, destroying his underwater home. So, Godzilla Has anybody ever is actually ready to seen lash out at anyone that stands the first in his Godzilla way. movie? A fun fact about this movie is that the monster's head was first imagined to be in the form of a mushroom cloud. How insane would a that mushroom look now cloud? If it be the case? King Kong vs. Godzilla. That would have looked so goofy if they did that. It is one of the most well-known crossover films in history. Godzilla well vs. King Kong. Japanese films. The main character of the film is a greedy publicist who uses King Kong as bait to try and sell more Didn't pharmaceutical they, like, advertisements on television. Didn't they, like, use actual people in suits for this? Godzilla and King Kong are at odds as King Kong travels to the mainland. Watch this classic <laughs> to find out who wins. Also, did you know that the pricey yak hair that made up the hair on the King Kong outfits yak was hair? Hand dyed by Kaimai Aizo? That's yak hair on Godzilla King Kong, gross! Godzilla vs. Mothra, 1964. Godzilla vs. Mothra. The research team travels to Infant Island in this part. I want to see what Mothra looks like by in 64. Cosmic talents to seek assistance as the world is on the verge By the way, guys, if you haven't yet, climate change scroll scenario. down. Hit that Godzilla subscribe button for your boy. As a result, I love you. And due to the uproar on Earth, he joins the fight against the monster. You know, it's starting to look a little better. Is that it had the largest attendance of all Godzilla films at the time. Largest the attendance of King all Godzilla, Godzilla films Godzilla at the time. Which sold roughly 12 million tickets. Huh. Godzilla That's a lot of tickets, the bro. Sea monster. The sea monster? This movie features is that supposed a to be destroyer? looking for his brother, who gets on a criminal's boat that capsizes on Lechi Island, where terrorists have imprisoned the That's inhabitants sick. I didn't of even know this. Island. Thus, That's probably they not decide destroyer, to though, is awaken it? Godzilla after spotting him asleep to free the villagers. No, nah, that's not. If you Definitely not. Become close to Infant Island. Apologies, but this was the last Godzilla movie to feature a South Seas native tribe, and the last Toho movie to feature the people which Godzilla the movie did they Island, actually Island, do it in suits? Their home. Son of Godzilla, 1967. Son Godzilla of Godzilla. Found some quiet moments amid all the battles to give birth to an heir. Bro, Godzilla right. used to look so film, goofy. Mantises unearth a mystery egg, which, when it hatches, reveals Manila. They're Godzilla's definitely in suits right now. Look how he's moving. Godzilla in a more Manila. comical and paternal way. This movie is ideal for some quality father-son time. Surprisingly, when this film was released on home video in Italy in the 1970s, Manila looking it was mad goofy. As a sequel to the 1961 British monster He's adorable. film Gorgo. Look how adorable Manila is, bro. That's Godzilla one of my favorite Godzilla. Godzilla. Versus Hedorah, 1971. Japan is once again under siege oh. in this Godzilla series. When Hedorah, a space-dwelling monster, travels to Earth to consume the garbage and pollution to build strength. The sulfuric acid mist oh, and Hedora. sludge this hazardous threat is spewing make it unlikely that either Godzilla or civilization okay, Godzilla will be able did to Godzilla did look a little it. better in this movie. Though, this film is the first and only movie to feature Godzilla flying, as well as utilizing really? his atomic power. Really? 71? Godzilla huh. vs. Gigan, 1972. Gigan. An evil gang of alien cockroaches that are looking for a new home planet arrives on Earth in this part. Which yeah, bro, they gotta still be in suits in this. Supernatural. You can tell by the Thus, way they're moving a little bit. You know what I'm saying? On tape, a manga artist starts to doubt his employers. Not to mention that although this movie was produced and distributed in Japan as a matinee for kids, they've got those the human movements. And violence in it earned it a TV 14 rating. Did he suplex Ghidorah? Television. Oh my gosh! Terror of Mecha Godzilla, 1975. That Featuring looks so a frustrated fake. scientist who decides to construct the creature after being shunned by the scientific world, it's time for Godzilla to rise as a savior again. This oh, look causes at Mecha G in the back. Okay, Mecha Godzilla looked really cool the early on. Of another mega beast known as Titanosaurus. This film, like Destroy All Monsters, is Dang, packed he got action. booted. The fact that this is not just the final Godzilla movie directed by Ishiro Honda, but also the last time Godzilla is portrayed as a hero until Godzilla Final Wars 2004 wow. makes it an interesting Wow. Dang, one. he wasn't a hero for 30 more years? The Return of Godzilla. 29, but you know what I'm saying? Godzilla dominated popular culture for three decades, before ultimately starting to lose some of its lusters. 
For nearly 10 years, Toho Pictures grappled with how to restore Godzilla's the been around for so long, bro. Reptile. I love it. So, they ultimately decided on a complete reboot that acted as a follow-up to the 1954 film, which meant that Godzilla was back. He's bigger, just coming around and eating everything. Than ever. Destroying. Not to mention, this is the first Godzilla movie to feature closing credits in its original Japanese language. Okay. Godzilla versus Biollante. I still haven't seen any of these. This that looks like a cool Godzilla. A depressed geneticist who produces a monster a little new mutation as a result of losing his daughter. He is Biolante, isn't that, that his the sister? The scientific community questions his science, yet he continues his bizarre experiment. And technically, the you know what I'm saying? centered upon every man for himself and planet versus plant versus reptile. I want to see what Biolante looks like in this. A total of a 10.7 million dollar budget, making it one of the most costly live action Japanese films produced at the time. Yeah, see live well action. The most expensive Godzilla movie created up to that date. So they were in suits for sure. Godzilla versus King Ghidorah. 1991, 1991. we're getting getting in closer. Movie, time travelers from 2204 visit present day Japan in 1991 to warn it of industrialization. They claim that if they don't try to stop Godzilla now, He's gonna He'll destroy be able everything. To destroy Japan, since Godzilla lives on nuclear energy. But yep. all you need to know is that this time and the heavy film does feature a fantastic battle between Godzilla and Mecha King Ghidorah in the sea. Mecha King making Ghidorah. It anything but simple. Oh, and to further enhance the credibility, they always of the have these lasers. Effects, actual octopus blood was used. Yep. Octopus Mothra blood. Why octopus? Godzilla, 1992. I didn't the movie have to is do based that. around greedy businessmen taking possession of Mothra's egg as it washes up on the shore, refusing to give it back to her fairies. Thus, Where is Mothra? I haven't even seen Infant her one time. Island must choose whether they will respond to Japan's. This is the evolution of Godzilla, not Godzilla Mothra. Godzilla emerges close to Nagoya. There she is. Not though. to forget that, except for the frontier missile sequence, this so is the beautiful. first Godzilla movie not to have significant revisions, as the picture stays true to the original plot. Godzilla vs. Okay. Mecha Godzilla 2, 1993. When did we the start Japanese getting like VFX and stuff United like that? Nations what Godzilla year was that? Center to create Mecha well, better Godzilla, ones, you know what I'm saying? Better. An anti-Godzilla device they call, as they are still recovering from the wars between Godzilla, Mothra, and Ghidorah from the previous Ooh. part. As a result, anarchy reigns supreme when Godzilla lands on land and decides the to beam attack clash. everyone who stands in his path. Even if doing so will result in his being killed. The by early a Mecha G's did machine. look really cool, Not bro. To mention, they all this did. This movie features the highest Godzilla screen time of any in the franchise, How accounting long? for over 20% of the total running length. What is Godzilla? Come on now. Godzilla versus Space Godzilla. Ooh, I want a more recent version in the of this. Of the film, Space, Space Godzilla? Godzilla is created as a result of cross pollination and an inexplicable space phenomenon. Godzilla then intervenes to defend Baby Godzilla and the inhabitants of Earth. Baby when the space G monster dares to harm them. Where's he at? Also, committing its 40th anniversary. Space Godzilla looks did so you know cool. That the American director Tim Burton reportedly informed the authors of a 2019 Japanese book about special effects movies from the High Sai era that this was his favorite Godzilla movie. Huh? Well, his favorite enough. from '94, huh? Godzilla okay. versus Destroyer. Burning Godzilla. 1995. Okay, this is Destroyer. After okay. being struck I like by this. an uranium explosion in Godzilla versus Destroyer, our favorite monster undergoes a frightening and I always just say Destroyer. Becoming burning you know what Godzilla. I'm saying. It's Destroyer, whatever. The Tokyo Bay Aqua Line is undergoing fresh construction, which causes a frightening reawakening of mutant crabs with the ability to combine Ooh. into one enormous creature known as Destoroya. Destroyer is a savage, man. day for Godzilla, right? I also, would like to see that movie, along with in a recent movie. Godzilla 1964, that would be sick. Was the only one in the Godzilla franchise to win the domestic box office championship for an for entire Frozen? year. Frozen Godzilla, Godzilla. 1998. Okay, now it's looking. proved to be quite interesting for the American audience. Now it's since looking Godzilla better. made its way to the Western audience for Godzilla. a reboot, the action juggernaut Roland Emmerich directed the star-studded production, which was overseen by actor Matthew Broderick from Inspector Gadget. Yeah, and that Ferris looks so Bueller's much Day better. Off. Additionally, it offered Godzilla a new Genesis tale in which a nest of lizards was accidentally mutated by French scientists during a lab a experiment nest of that lizards? went horribly wrong. Why? Not to mention, the movie utilized enough paint to cover the whole Golden Gate Bridge. Dang! That's right. On the other hand, the cast and crew of this film ordered It's Gojira, You Moron t-shirts for fun. <laughs> Godzilla 2000 Millennium. Millennium, 1999. 
Now we're getting, yeah, we're getting into some cool more. movies now. To the fundamentals of the monster brand after a string I think of after that Burning Godzilla reviews. and Destroy so a Fight, this particular project, it just gets better. The Millennium series as part of this new strategy. I think anyways. Standalone movies over overlapping continuity. Bro, this Millennium's is why Atomic Godzilla Breath, 2000 whatever is the you want to call it, crazy. The series, standing apart from the 40 decade old canon that came before it. The story of this part revolves around an alien race that wants to use Godzilla's DNA Ugh. for generating abilities to become immortal and conquer the entire planet. They need to make some more Godzilla, Godzilla movies, bro. Bring Megagirus, back the old characters. 2000. The second film in the Millennium series centers on an artificial black hole technology that goes awry. Featuring Japan, which engineers an artificial black hole device to imprison Godzilla permanently. Artificial black hole a device. Test of the what? Device results in the creation of new enemies for Godzilla. It's always the something Queen like Mega that. Gyrus and car-sized dragonflies known as Meganula. More competition for Godzilla, right? How did also, this movie did get worse than the 1998 Godzilla? From movies from the 1950s as far as like VFX and their casting in this part as well. Yoriko Hoshi, who had previously portrayed Yoka in Mothra vs. Godzilla, plays Yoshina Yoshizawa in this sequel. What's the next one? Give me something good. Godzilla against Mechagodzilla. Against Mechagodzilla. They, they couldn't the do verses because it already series, happened. This time, Godzilla battles Mechagodzilla, which is controlled by a person inside the machine. The 1954 Godzilla Inside movie provides the, machine. the basis what? for the previous movies. However, this one claims that Godzilla is still alive since his bone bits have survived. Basically a win-win situation for the audience. Yes, plot Interestingly, armor, you know? Director Tezuka intended I like it. to include a moment when Yumiko Shaku, who plays the lead role, swims past the camera up close while wearing a swimsuit. He regrets leaving it out to this day. Yep, that's right. That's interesting. <laughs> What's the next one? Give me something good, bro. I need some good Godzilla, VFX. Tokyo SOS 2003. The first and <clears throat> I don't know final about this film movie. in the Millennium series to be I don't a know about any of the older the movies. For it is the fifth installment. After facing Godzilla the year before, the Mecha Godzilla robot good. is upgraded and repaired in this film. But will humanity it almost act look like an anime. when Godzilla, Mecha Godzilla, and Mothra? Continue that Mothra their looks conflict? so fake. A quick fact check reveals that the movie is the only one in the Millennium series to share continuity with a work from the same era, serving as a oh, direct that sequel Godzilla to Godzilla nice. vs. Mechagodzilla 3, 2002. Bro, I'm telling you, all the Mechagodzillas look good. All Godzilla, of them. Godzilla, Final Wars, Most 2004. Of them. The sixth and last tale in the Millennium series was portrayed in this series. Final and Wars, me, Godzilla. The movie is packed with action, Monsters and he's cool. He's cool looking to coincide with the Godzilla franchise's 50th anniversary. My boy looks me officially doesn't seem to be connected to the original 1954 movie. It does resemble 1968's destroy all monsters in certain ways. Okay, Despite that was nice. Look at that. Movies where Godzilla was mostly an ally. Here, Godzilla must battle the impulse to harm people in order to safeguard the greater good. Okay, that had a nice storyline. Here we go. <clears throat> Godzilla Finally. is prepared to wreak havoc in San Francisco in yet another American remake of the classic. Now that Godzilla, is Godzilla. A godlike creature is the only ally to mankind in this series. Come and on is now. to aid in defending Earth against other hazardous monsters. That this is one Godzilla. This is a jam-packed action movie and a fantastic place to start if you're seeking for a Godzilla entry. For sure. Not to for mention sure. Great movie. filming, cinematographer Seamus McGarvey unintentionally visited the lakeside set of Dawn of the Planet of the Apes because it resembled this one quite a bit. Beautiful. Beautiful. Shin Godzilla, 2016. Shin I still Godzilla, haven't seen it. Godzilla Resurgence. I know, I'm disappointed. Just as Toho disappointed Company as you are. In Japan 12 years <clears throat> after the last Japanese Godzilla movie, Godzilla Final Wars. After nuclear waste leaks into Tokyo Bay and causes you see, a mystery that looks so good to too. evolve, this film's Godzilla origin story adopts a sort of Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle style. Mutant Ninja it's worth Turtle. Huh? That Kiano, the director, originally planned to incorporate a family drama and a romance subplot in the film. Would have been fun if that were to be the case, right? I guess, but you know, Shin Godzilla. Yeah. Godzilla. King He's of cool the enough. Monsters, 2019. Given how many times the Godzilla property has been remade, it is impressive that this is the first direct sequel to an American version. This Michael so Dougherty sick, directed bro. and co-written movie takes the relationship between Godzilla and the U.S. military and Dang. takes it to Antarctica as the monster battles. See, I wish they had this many titans, monsters in the, <clears throat> the most Rodan. recent. 
An interesting mm. fact Godzilla vs. Kong, is sorry. Godzilla is regarded as more of an infinite That would be cool. Real I want to see a recent Godzilla movie with all of the Godzilla monsters. Godzilla. That would be insane. Destroyer, Godzilla everybody, Space Godzilla. Kong, 2021. The 36th installment, Kong Skull Island, serves as a sequel to both the 2014 and 2019 this Godzilla This was a great films, movie, as well in as my the opinion. 2017 King Kong reboot. I it really enjoyed it. It is directed by your next alum, Adam Wingard. The two monsters engage in a battle of epic dimensions that epic must be seen dimensions. and believed. When Godzilla detects a disturbance on Skull Island, who do you think will win this battle? Well, I What's think Godzilla more, will win will because Godzilla we've seen the movie. After the most recent installment in one of the longest running franchises ever. They need to make that more movies. We'll have to wait and see. That will have to Not wait. Other than that, that is the end of this video. Who, who would you like to see in a more recent Godzilla movie? Let me know in the comments. Thank you guys for watching with me. I'll see you tomorrow. I love ya. Goodbye.